Whether you're in Little League or in the big leagues, no matter what level you're at, you're excited for opening night and really exciting day. And, you know, the stats start to count now. You know, you go through spring training, stats don't count, but now they count. So it's time to start reeling off some Ws. Got guys that can play a lot of positions. We got some little bit of power, got a little bit of speed, got a little bit of everything. So I'm excited just about the whole aspect of the team. I think winning is part of developing, you know. Uh, guys got to learn how to win. And if you look at it day by day, you go out and you win as many games as possible. At the end of the season, you have a lot of wins. You play in postseason games, and, and that develops. What does a, uh, a Dave Berg uh, coach team look like on the field? We haven't seen Look at him right now. <laughs> that's, a, that's a team. Uh, I don't know. I guess just playing hard and having fun. Uh, that's what I try to preach to these guys. You know, you go out every day and you play as hard as you can and have as much fun as you can. And at the end of the year, your results are going to be there. There's always jitters. Uh, you know, it's a long off season. And you look forward to the opening night, and you just uh, you train your whole life to slow the game down. Um, and it's just another game. You know, the, obviously the juices are going to be flowing a lot more, but uh, it's just another game. How fun was the championship last year? You know, you know, coming from a uh, coming from a team that wasn't winning as much, um, just to, just to get here, and we won pretty much every game. Uh, once I got up here and uh, just the chemistry and the guys involved that uh, are going to be future big leaguers and future guys that uh, will have an impact. Um, so just winning again and champagne showers are no joke. You know, those are those are very fun. And, you know, if we could do it every year, I'd love to. Um, and I think we got a good squad this year to do it again. What do you think about the other guys in rotation? Uh, you know, I came up last year with a few of these guys, you know, uh, Austin has power stuff. Um, he, he's going to be a, a great guy for us. Jake as well. Um, I think we're very similar pitchers um, with our repertoire and how we attack hitters. Chipper is a great lefty for us. Um, you know, he had great success with the Hammerheads last year as well as the Suns. And then Flores has just been amazing. Um, seeing him in spring training, you know, I play catch with him every day. We were throwing partners and seeing uh, what he can bring to the, uh, the team is going to be great for us. Even watching on TV for the major league games, I mean, I still get chills no matter uh, no matter how old I am, truly. It's really exciting. The Marlins, they pick me up in the Rule 5, and that makes me think at least that they want to see me do well and see how I can do with them and at a new level, double A being my first year. Tim Montez at JU, the pitching coach, now head coach, uh, recruited me and got me to come down here. Beautiful Florida, can't complain. And every offseason now I spend here. Uh, go back to New York once or twice to see the family. That's about it. <laughs> Every year opening day is emotional. Yeah. Just because of the long off season, you're so excited. You want everything to go good. And uh, this year I'm just trying to kind of sit back outside of myself and observe and, you know, really smell the roses, yeah. as they yeah. say, as we go through everything for the whole year. And uh, opening night is, uh, the, you know, media day here the night before is always the same thing. Great fun. And then tomorrow night, uh, yeah, I'm liable to have some tears. Yeah. It's going to be fun ringing that bell. I think of the old man every time. Yeah. Mother's coming tomorrow night. Hopefully we'll roll her down here and let her flip out a pitch. She asked me, she said, are you going to throw the first pitch? And I said, if you want to come, I want you to throw it. I said, I might throw it on Labor Day. I might hold Labor Day. <laughs>